Alright ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to another episode of ASA, the series where I answer your questions. I got six questions to answer today so let's get started with a scammer Studios and he says, Will you be collecting any of the Lord of the Rings sets that will be coming out in 2023? So though I absolutely adored the Lord of the Rings and the Hobbit and even the Rings of Power, I'm probably not going to get any of the Lego sets just because I like Star Wars and Star Wars sets are expensive. I think it'll be cool cool to see Lord of the Rings come back, but I'm not going to get any of the sets. Next question is from Plurpus. ASA, if you could go to any planet in Star Wars, which one would you go to and why? Honestly, I would say screw planets. I just want to go on the Death Star. Imagine cruising around the galaxy in a giant space station, being able to just destroy planets whenever you feel like it, like it's in your way. Boom. Now it's not. The only reason why I wouldn't want to be on there is because of the exhaust pipe. We would have to find a way to block that off or hide it better because... And we can't have that happening again. Next question is from Bowie Bricks, and he says, ASA, I just found pieces to complete my Kiyayu Mundi. I don't think I said that right. And Barisalfi and Young Obi-Wan parts to complete the figs in a lost Lego box. And have you ever found any like Lego that you lost a long time ago and maybe it's kind of valuable or something? What? To be completely honest with you, I'm not sure if I understand this question all that well. I store all my Lego in bins and my minifigures in bins and all that stuff, so I would like to say that I'm very organized when it comes to my Lego. I would say that I'm pretty organized in that aspect. However, I did drop Darth Maul's lightsaber down my air vent, which kind of sucks. So here's where my table is. This is where I do all my recording and all that. And right next to me where I sit or stand is an air vent. And one time I was cleaning up and I dropped Maul's lightsaber. So that was kind of sucky. Next question is from BT Animates and he says, ASA, have you ever animated? No, I have not as of right now. It's possible that I will someday. Probably not, but maybe, who knows? Like, I don't, so I don't really have any desire to animate anytime soon, but I might. But as of right now, I have not. And our last two questions are technically the same question. They're worded a little bit differently, but basically they're both, what is my opinion on and or TV series? So I'm not actually going to to talk about individual episodes because as of right now there's eight because episode eight just dropped today but i don't want to spoil anything so that's why i'm not going to talk about each individual episode up to where we are right now so i will just say though that the show is really amazing i'm really enjoying it so far i think it's a little bit different from typical star wars because we don't have a lot of like chase scenes in space and lightsabers and all that stuff so it's definitely different it's very kind of slow pace which you would think would be bad because you would think oh that means it must be boring but I think it's really enjoyable how slow it's going. It's more enjoyable to be able to sit down and watch an episode that's actually an hour long. One of my reasons why I didn't like the book of Boba Fett was because some of the episodes are like 30 minutes and it's like, That's it? That's the last episode? That was just a bunch of cheap walk cycles! What a rip! I was just kind of disappointed with that. So I think that's one of the reasons why I really like Andor is because it's just taking its sweet time, but it's doing a great job while doing that. So I really do enjoy the show. I don't know if that technically answers your question. I'm really enjoying it. And if for some reason anyone here has not seen it yet, go watch it. Do it. I also wanted to point out that I committed a crime in the last episode. I forgot to say thank you for the potatoes. Thank you for the potatoes in last episode and this episode. Of course, as well, thank you for the comments and for watching. Make sure you leave a like on the video. If you enjoyed, it does help out a lot. Ask a question or two for the next episode, and I will pin my favorite to the top. Yada, yada, yada. Have a wonderful day, and I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye. That was weird.